a good moment there. That's yeah. the moment Alice Mary Johnson found out that she was granted clemency and she was going home after nearly 22 years behind bars. Wow. Kim Kardashian, of course, played a huge role in getting her released, as did this defense attorney, Sean Holly. Oh, yeah. Her resume Ooh, power is broker. endless. Along with the Kardashians, Holly has represented Kanye West, Justin Bieber, Lindsay Lohan, just, you know, name dropping a few of the times. <laughs> and her very public career started back with O.J. Simpson, so there's a connection as well oh, yeah. to Kim Kardashian. But let's start with Kim here. How did you broker that deal to get her into the White House in front of President Trump? You know what? I really have to give most of the credit to Kim. I mean, yeah. Kim texted me. She had seen the story about Alice Marie Johnson on her Twitter feed, mm -hmm. and she said, let's try to get this woman out of jail. And I'm like, okay. Right. <laughs> that seemed impossible. Um, but Kim is relentless. Yeah. And we went about it kind of in two different ways. I started focusing on the legal case. Mm -hmm. She started working her relationships with Ivanka Trump, um, Kushner. And um, we kind of came together. He, Jared, needed a number of different documents, and I would work with the legal team to get the documents that he needed in order to bring the case to the Oval Office. And um, it ended with our being there before the president. And um, okay, but White what's House going counsel. on in that picture, though? We really want to know. Because I'll yeah. be honest with you, to, it was odd even to see him smiling. <laughs> like he is cheesing in this photo. Um, you know what? I think he was excited that Kim yeah. was there. Yeah, I think so. I think, I think so. so. I really I do. do. Agree. That is I definitely do. the She's, look. Uh, a big star and yeah. a beautiful woman. So there and you Alice go. Johnson, what's she doing now? How is she? She is amazing. She is speaking all over the country about prison reform. She is an incredible ambassador herself because she served 22 years for a first time nonviolent drug offense. She took advantage of every um, class program while in prison. She was a model prisoner wow. and she can really speak to these issues. She's um, just doing amazingly. And you work with Kanye. Tell us something about Kanye in and out of the news. There's people coming up. Give us your take on Kanye. Kanye is a genius. I mean, he's a creative genius. I think we find with creative geniuses that they can kind of do and say provocative things. Mm -hmm. He is no exception. Yeah. Uh, well said. Mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> Very well said. Uh, As an attorney would speak, you would expect. Uh, you yes. and the OJ trial. Oh, yes. Uh, yes. I mean, I feel like there's this endless fascination with OJ yes. and that trial. Yes. Um, I want, do, what does Shapiro and Cochran really have? I mean, because some of the shows you've seen, it seemed like they were like at some point spitting venom at one another. Was it really that contentious between the two of them during the trial? Um, it was pretty contentious. Really? It was pretty contentious. I mean, the reality is that Shapiro understood that a time would come that mm -hmm. the baton would be passed to Johnny and Johnny's team. Um, we had a lot more trial experience at that time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but I don't think that Robert Shapiro really understood what he would be giving up because it was incredibly seductive to yeah. be mm -hmm. at the center of that. Everybody was oh, watching. Yeah. It was major. And, and then when you have shows on it since, everybody's yeah. watching those. Yes, yes. So I think it was hard for him to pass the baton when it came time to do that. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I mean, he did a number of brilliant things in his own right. There was a time that he was involved in the case before we were and did some great things. Yeah. I just think that it was hard to kind have of let go. And you're from OJ? I haven't heard from O.J. in a while. I thought about writing him a few times when he was in prison in Nevada, mm -hmm. but then I wasn't sure to what I would say. What? Exactly. That was why I yes. did it. I right. didn't know what I would say. Like, what are you doing? Or, hi. I didn't well, know. What did you think <laughs> of the verdict? I mean, in, honestly. In our case? Yes. Well, you know what? Do you think he was innocent? We all believed throughout the time that we represented him that he did not do this. Really? We really, really did. And I will tell you that we had a psychologist put him through a battery of tests very early on. Mm -hmm. The psychologist we chose was someone who was, would be predisposed to not give the, him the yeah. benefit of the doubt. She was the mother of the battered women's defense syndrome. Mm -hmm. And after she put him through all of these tests, she came back and she reported to us that she did not think that he did it. Yeah, but this was and a psychologist went, you hired, But though, right? she was a psychologist we hired who would not give him the benefit okay. of the doubt, someone who would be definitely against him what do and you their think past. Now? And then she said, however, if he did it, he has no idea that he did it. Interesting. Like a sort like of a fit of rage or a pathological denial. Anyway, the point is, every single thing he said or did was completely consistent with what an innocent person would say or do in every instance. And as the low man on the tonal pole, I spent a lot of time with OJ. Yeah. And the LAPD made a number of missteps, so it was kind of easy yeah. if you believed in him to go. I don't know. This evidence is not really. So, but, but then now he wrote the book. in your heart of hearts, 
What do you think? <laughs> My heart of heart. <laughs> well, I will say that over all of this time, when you look back at it from a point of distance, right. it seems that there was a lot of evidence. Right. However, you know, you can't really assess the evidence when it has been tampered with, mm -hmm. as I believe it was. Would We're you have advised against the book? Would you have said, OJ, yes. don't If you? I did yes. it, book? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. I would have. Uh, yeah. I think all of us would have. Yes. 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 Agreed. Wait, we can't uh, let it go. We haven't gotten into Lindsay Lohan. Let me just ask you this. Okay, hang on. We're going to do another interview. <laughs> I need to, you're like the real life Olivia Pope. We got you so many trouble. questions. No, no, no.